Hell yeah, what's up guys? It's Curse Pike. My friends call me Big C. Back in action today, I got another quick tip for you. For those of you that make videos, I'm going to show you how to remove backgrounds like I've done in this one here. You'll see here I took out the green in the TV. This is a green screen video. And then the second one here, I went and grabbed this lady here and I just pulled the entire background out. And then I put another background in behind it. So how did I do this? Well, let's start from scratch. I'm going to show you. Let's delete everything here. First step here, I'm going to go up here into import and then you'll see stock materials. Under stock materials, I'll make it a little bigger here for you. I'm just going to go ahead and type in TV and here we go. When I type in TV, I'm going to find a couple of options. I kind of like this one here. So we're going to grab that one and we're going to just drag and drop it onto the timeline. Next, I'm going to go ahead and click on this and move it up into the second video track position because we're going to put something in behind it. Okay, if you're following along with me, let's go back into stock materials here. And then let's think about something that we want to put in behind it. So I don't know, let's go to background. And then I'm going to select, I like this blue one here. This looks pretty wild. Let's go ahead and drag that and put it underneath. So there we go. So we've got a few seconds of that. Now, you don't see anything yet, but that's okay. I'm going to go and click on the top track here. I'm going to grab this handle. I'm just going to pull it in so they're both the same length. This is really easy so far, and I just want to make sure that you guys get the whole, you know, you get the point. You don't have to be extremely precise here. Just, you know, get it good. So there we go. I'm going to click on the top video. Now I'm clicking on the video track two, which has got the green screen TV. I'm going to go over here to the right side, and then under video, you're going to see remove background. What we want to do is now click on chroma key, and when you do that, you just want to click on this little pen tool, and when you click on it, don't let go. Just click on it and then drag it over without letting go of the mouse and then presto i'm going to go ahead and pull out the green there we go so i've gone ahead and done that and you'll see here that it selected the green for me i am going to go ahead and increase the intensity to about 50 and the reason why i did that is because around the edge you'll see some fraying green you know some people call it spill stuff like that well there was a little bit of spill a little bit of leak so we just increased the intensity and I'm going to increase the shadow a little bit as well. Now, let's take a look at what we got here. I'm going to go right back to the beginning. Check this out. We have a green screen technique. It was literally that easy. If I click on the bottom here, if I click on the bottom video, you'll see here up at the top, I can pull the handles as well. So if I want to make this a little smaller, or if I want to re, you know, maybe I want to put the, the crazy little blue thing right in the middle of the TV like this. Now, take a look here. Look at that. That is how you green screen in CapCut and it is completely free. So that is why this is so cool. Okay, the second technique, well, I got you here. Let's go back to device here. I'm going to go to stock materials. And of course, you can bring your own content in if you see fit. But I'm just going to go ahead and use their stock stuff. So that way, if you want to follow along, you could follow along with me. I'm going to go ahead and click on life. And under life, you get some, you know, you get some videos of people doing stuff. This is the one that I used earlier. Here she is just walking away from, yeah, every girl walks away from me. This is just like life imitating art or whatever the heck the saying is. So there we go. We got a girl, you know, she's pretty girl walking away, you know, just like they do. And uh, here we go. We want to get rid of the background. So the first thing I'm going to do before I do that is again, put this second, put the video on the second track here. And then I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to click on background again. And now what do we want her in for a background? So I don't know. I'm thinking maybe something like, do, should we have her in the trees? So oh, that sounded weird. Let's do something fun like this crazy little uh, <laughs> gradient uh, animation. So I'm going to put her against this as the background. So there we go. So this, of course, you won't see yet. So we're just going to go ahead and make them the same length. And now watch this. I'm going to make sure that I'm clicked on the lady here. I've clicked on her, go over here to video, and then instead of basic, go to remove background and then go down to auto removal right here. When you do that, gone. The background is gone. Let's see what we got. Holy smoky dokey. Now it is a little bit of shade in there and a little bit of, you know, lighting issues because it's never a hundred percent perfect, but it's still really, really, really good. And again, this is a free technique. So I just hit play here and bam. Last thing I do want to show you is you can make a few other changes here. So if you want it to look like, you know, one of those uh, YouTube videos where you've got the white around the edges, just go ahead and click on this stroke here. You can add all kinds of different strokes. 
You can add one with an offset. You can add one with uh, dashed lines. And then, of course, the most popular one, which is the regular stroke. And then maybe we'll increase the size of it. And presto, let's see what that looks like, actually. Look at that. That is super cool, guys. Again, completely free. Those are the techniques. Thanks for watching.